Shall we get rolling? We should. Let's get it. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the Big Freaking Health Coach Podcast. I'm Big Freaking Neil, and I'm joined, of course, as always, without exception, my business partner, buddy brain twin, Health Coach Kane. I think I flip flop the order on the beats every single time. That's fine. I always like There's right no before. Fire. <laughs> Drinking that cool receptic, numbing the pain, forgetting our names like everyone's epileptic. Oh, they're giving us seizures now. Oh, we don't need no preachers now. Oh, just shut your eyes and get with the times, cause everyone's freaking out. Yeah, everyone's freaking out. Yeah, everyone's freaking out. Just open your eyes and stare at the sky, cause everyone's freaking out. Yeah, everyone's freaking out. Yeah, everyone's freaking out. Just shut your eyes and get with the times Cause everyone's freaking out Brian? Good, how are you doing? Doing well. How's the body hold? Up? This ain't a diss track or a clap back pissing match. This ain't the blues, this ain't hip hop, this ain't rap. Is it rock and roll? Well, I can't answer that. To tell the truth, I don't even know where I'm at. I'm a lone wolf, stuck in sheep's clothing. I can't stand the thought of all the other sheep knowing that I'm not one of you. Never really was. Is that ketchup on my muzzle? Now you know it's blood. Time finally comes to take this planet back. Breaks for the backlash. This ain't a comeback or a climb back to the top. They say when you're at the bottom, then there's nowhere else to go but up. I call bullshit. 
but I'll keep climbing. Hand over hand, foot over foot, and I'm still smiling. Tooth and nail, claws are out, and I'm after blood. Did I mean to say blood, or am I searching for love? Someone to help me through the dark times. Someone to tell me when it's over and I can open my eyes. To the truth, I need proof. Seeing is believing. Fake news, real news. Sick of the deceiving. Sick of the bleeding. Sick of the feeling. Sick of the healing. Sick of the lies. Sick of the lies. Sick of seeing people die. So, obviously a little bit of a different format. I primarily wanted to provide you guys with something with a little bit more production value and a little bit more of a in-depth personal look into my life. It's not just me rambling at you for 20 minutes at a time. I feel like there's a lot of people in the fitness world, especially the bodybuilding world, that don't show their real day-to-day -day lives. It's a lot of highlight reels, but social media as a whole is definitely all about everyone's best foot forward. None of the hard stuff, none of the ugly stuff, none of the not so sexy stuff. I wanna go against the mold. This ain't a revolution, this ain't even a solution It's a message to the people who are sick of this institution Trust me, I get it, it's a lose-lose situation Rich get richer, but they fall into a deep depression Social media backlash, cause everyone's so mad But if everyone were chill, they see that people ain't that bad Right, left, forward, back, everyone knows that Something needs to change besides fighting about hashtags What's up guys, this is my client Shreyas. I'm doing a uh, day in the life video today. Yeah? Yeah, welcome, welcome in. Always watch these from the other side, now I get to see I you. I know, now you're in one. No, this is something different. I'm doing like a new little video series. All right, all right. It's gonna be pretty cool. I completely forgot to post any training footage from my leg workout, but do you wanna hear about it? Yes, yeah, sir. So I did uh, sumo deadlifts, high rep for 12s. It was pretty hard and I super set or I guess compound set uh, band RDLs from a box what else did I do I did a hamstring and glute dominant leg press so my heels all the way to the top of the sled and I super set a front relaxed pose where you tear the floor with your feet you'll hear all about this soon and I held those for 30 seconds at a time. And then I did a John Meadows style cluster set on the leg curl where you do, you pick the weight that you can maybe get for 10 to 12, but you do 25 of them. And you just rest pause until you get them. So it's pretty good. When are we recreating this for me? Hmm? When do I get to do all that? You can do it right now if you want. Do it next leg day? I'm also doing all my food today. So this is uh, rice cakes. Same. This is the same thing I had pre-workout that I already showed. Uh, rice cakes with tuna and actual rice and mustard. You have rice cakes and actual rice? Mm-hmm. Why don't you just eat it on the rice cakes? What, without the rice? Yeah, and you can just eat it like that instead of... This won't be enough carbs oh. for my refeed. Well, why did you make a sandwich like Rice crispy or <laughs> rice cake, rice meat, crispy. and then. <laughs> This ain't a revolution, this ain't even a solution It's a message to the people who are sick of this institution Trust me, I get it, it's a lose-lose situation Rich get richer, but they fall into a deep depression Social media backlash, cause everyone's so mad But if everyone were chill, they see that people ain't that bad Right, left, forward, back, everyone knows that Something needs to change besides fighting about hashtags
Brace for the backlash. 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 Session, big deadlift form. This is meal number three, technically, since I split two into into two different parts. Um, I've got here some more tuna, cup and a half of white rice, which I'm loving, and some broccoli. Okay guys, just stopped by the store and got some goodies for tonight. So my refeed tradition for dessert is to pick out a different total fat kid cereal every week. The criteria are can't be high in fat because that defeats the purpose. It's got to be primarily carbohydrates, but luckily the vast majority of fat kid cereals are entirely made of carbs and sugar. So tonight's choice is Oreo O's. Looks like basically Cheerios made from Oreos. So very excited about that. I'll be putting uh, Fair Life high protein lactose free milk in that. Um, but first, I have three different varieties of sushi. Two of these. What I'm looking for when I pick out my sushi for a refeed again is low fat so i'm looking for the rice and the fish just the simplest rolls i can find i'm avoiding a whole bunch of cream cheese um this second variety that i got does appear to have some avocado but that's okay i've eaten basically no fat all day today so a little avocado in there is not going to hurt me um, or hinder my refeed in any way and then it also comes with i can't remember what they're called but the bigger strip of, of meat, bigger strip of fish on top of the rice. So excited, guys. Okay, almost home. I cannot believe how smoky it is right now. Oh my gosh, it looks like it's completely overcast. And I'm pretty sure there's not a cloud in the sky. It's just all smoke, it's wild. So anyway, almost home. I had a couple of cancellations at the end of my day. One, is actually due to the smoke. One of them has pretty bad asthma and just sort of doesn't want to leave the house right now, which I completely understand, I wouldn't either. Um, cause I don't have asthma and it's pretty hard to breathe. Not going to lie. And the other one is an outdoor client. I trained him at a public park and not trying to encourage him to inhale a whole bunch of smoke while he works out. So got off, finished up with clients a little early. Um, which is great because I have some work that I need to get done from home now. And then once I wrap that up and the wife gets home, it's sushi time.
so good. My inner fat kid is so happy.